Can you help George tell which boats are bigger or smaller than other boats? <laughs> Carefully, which boat is the biggest? And press enter on your remote. Oops, that's not the biggest. Please try again. Which one is the biggest? Please select which one you think is the biggest. <laughs> Correct. That boat is bigger than the other two boats. Can you tell which boat is the smallest? <laughs> that's right, George. Smallest is the opposite of biggest. <laughs> okay. Please look carefully at these three boats. Which one is the smallest? One of these is smaller. Which one could it be? Please make a choice. One of these boats is smaller than the other two. But which one, I wonder? Please find the smallest one. You chose the smallest boat. Let's look at these next three boats. Which one is the longest? Which do you think is the longest? That's not quite the longest. Have another go. Ah. You're doing wonderfully. That is indeed the longest boat. <laughs> Please choose the longest boat again, but from these three boats. Very good. That boat is longer than the other two boats. <laughs> Do you know the opposite of long? <laughs> the opposite of long is short. <laughs> One of these boats is shorter than the other two boats. Can you help George choose which boat is the shortest? That boat is the shortest. Sure, you can choose the shortest boat again. Would you like to try? Okay, which of these three boats is the shortest? There's no shortage of boats here. One must be shorter than this. Can you find it? Correct. You chose the shortest boat. Well done. Wider than other boats. There must be a wider one. Please have another try. Please choose the widest one and press enter. Yes, that's right. You chose the widest boat. Please look carefully at these three boats. Which one is the widest? Very good. That boat is wider than the other boats. Now, what could the opposite of wide be? You're right, George. The opposite of wide is narrow. Which of these boats is the narrowest? Which one do you think is the narrowest? Excellent. That boat is certainly the narrowest. Uh -huh. Let's try one more narrow boat. Uh -huh. Which one of these three is the most narrow? Well done. You chose the narrowest boat. Uh -huh. You certainly know your sizes when it comes to boats. But how well do you know your sizes when it comes to other objects? Uh -huh. Shall we? Uh -huh. Which ball is the biggest? Well done. Uh -huh. Now let's look at some fruit. Which piece of fruit is the smallest? Is it the orange, the grapefruit, or the cherry? All this fruit is making me hungry. Ah. Excellent work. You chose the cherry, and the cherry is the smallest piece of fruit. That's right, you do prefer bananas to cherries, George. Uh -huh. Let's see what I have for you right here. Uh -huh. Which of these bananas is the longest? Choose a banana quick, before George gets too hungry. Oh. You chose the longest banana. Uh -huh. Yes, George has his eye on that banana for later. Don't you, George? Please take a look at these three pickles. Can you choose the pickle that is the shortest? Well done. That pickle is the shortest. You're very good at this. And George agrees. Let's look at some kites. Which kite is the widest? Very good. You chose the widest kite. George loves kites, don't you, George? Look carefully at these three flags. Which one is the narrowest? Very nice. That flag is the narrowest flag. Well done. Let's take a closer look at those flags with our binoculars. Those pirates have taken Captain Hundley's flag and have put their pirate Jolly Roger over it. But it looks like some pirates have put their Jolly Roger on some other flag. Can you tell which object is being covered on this flag? Is it an ice cream, a milk carton, or a wedge of cheese? The pirates covered the cream. Which object has been covered up by the pirates this time? A shovel, a stroller, or a wagon? The pirates have covered a different object. What could it be? It must be a different object. Please try again. Now these pirates have been very busy. Did the pirates cover a crate of flowers, a radio, or a tent? Excellent work. The pirates covered... Hmm... This time, the pirates have covered a flag with a picture of something that has wheels. What could it be? Is it a car? A fire truck? 
or a trailer. It's a fire truck. <laughs> Is it a flashlight, a roller skate, or a trumpet? Now please look carefully at this flag. Do you see an apple, an orange, or a banana? That's correct. You chose the banana. Well done. <laughs> oh yes, you've made George very happy. <laughs> And you've managed to spot all of the different objects on the flags. I don't think the pirates will come back here. Thank you for playing with us.